Listen up. Tell me what you hear. Look at the bottom of the screen and tell me what you see. That's an auditor's shoe, and if you combine the sound with the shoe, you're about to witness the greatest post office audit ever. Hi. Hello. I'm Kara. Are you the manager? I am not the manager. I am the uh, supervisor. Okay, Karen is the post office supervisor, and we're about to get into a verbal gymnastics discussion on poster seven. So we'll go right to the scoreboard. Photographs may be taken only with the permission of the local postmaster or installation head. Well, Karen here is the installation head. No picture can depict any postal service employee. And Karen is also a postal employee. No picture can depict any Postal Service employee, customer, security camera. If you look closely, you'll see all types of security cameras on the wall there. And if the auditor uses his zoom lens, he would get the cover of mail from this guy holding up his hand. So he violated every Poster 7 regulation that you can say. But they still insist that they can film at post offices. But that's not what this video is about today. I think you understand from watching my videos that auditors misquote almost every line in Poster 7. I know everything about your policies. Mm -hmm. I'm not here to create drama or anything, but mm -hmm. you can't give me your wrong information, ma'am. No. I'm just video recording uh, allowed by law and allowed by the Constitution and allowed by the post office. By their postal uh, postmaster or manager of the building or the police. Poster 7. Here it is. Rules and regulations on postal property or security force personnel or other authorized personnel or uh, federal court or order or rule. Other photo photographs may be taken only with the permission of the local postmaster or installation head. You know, it's funny. This guy, it appears that it's, this is the first time he's ever read fully Poster 7. It appears it's the first time he ever got down to uh, other photographs may be taken only with the permission of the installation head. And he don't know what to do. So here's what he makes up. Other photo photographs may be taken only with the permission of the local postmaster or installation head. That means like other photographs like behind that door. You know, he was really reaching with behind that door. We have it right here where it says that uh, they need a, a, a sign that says that I can't film. I know many of you have seen maybe hundreds of post office uh, audit videos, and they talk about they need a sign. This is the sign. Poster 7 is the sign. You're looking at it. You're looking at the sign that says you can't photograph in post offices. I have it right here where it says that uh, they need a, a, a sign that says that I can't film. And, and actually, the only sign that they have is this one right here. And now to the meat of our program, the action scene. And I would like to point out here that some inconsistencies between auditor words and auditor actions. What's your, what are you going to video record? I'm video. Come on, touch me. You must touch me. Bitch. Touch me. Out touch me. Up. Touch me. Touch me. Touch me. Touch me. Really? Bitch. I'm a journalist. I'm a journalist. Let's deal with inconsistency number one. The auditor's taunting the guy with, come on, touch me, as he's running away. Touch me. You must come touch me. Bitch. Touch me. Touch me. Touch me. Touch me. Touch me. And the second inconsistency of, I'm a journalist. I'm a journalist. The judge implied that I was just going around harassing people and calling it journalism. To no, you're not. No, you're not. Yo, yo, what the fuck is your problem? You psycho. I'm not getting out of here. Oh, you. Oh, wow. I've done nothing to you. Yeah, I will do something. I've done nothing to you. Avoiding all these people. No, I'm not. I'm working. Get the fuck out of here, bro. Get away from me, bro. Get away from me, bro. Get away from me, bro. Get away from me. Get away from me. Come on, bro, get, get away from me. Be a fucking bro, man. Get away. He can't be a man. He's an auditor. And they will only be aggressive and taught those who can't snap their necks. 
But our new crazy guy is serious, and auditors will always punk out with a real man. Be a fucking no, man. So as you can see, this auditor's camera shield is not working. It's definitely not working. Neither are his threats. What's your way you gonna video record? I'm video. Come on, touch me. You must be a touch me. Bitch. Touch me. Oh. I'm gonna call the police. You just threatened oh, me. Okay. I'm not getting out of here. Get away from me, bro. Get away from me, bro. You know, most normal human beings would just punt here. But this auditor is stupid enough to follow this great crazy guy to his truck and get the mandatory license plate. So the auditor's plan has some glitches. Like this guy, the wild and crazy guy, isn't playing with the auditor or with a full deck. K K M two six two. Legs don't fail me now. K K M two six two. Another slight miscalculation by the auditor. This guy's crazy as fuck. Crazy guy got in his truck and is making a U-turn. This guy's crazy as fuck. You guessed it. Uh, the auditor is now in a foot race with a truck and an angry, very angry man. <laughs> You know, I don't know about you, but after listening to auditors' insults, their threats and BS, the sight of this auditor running the 440 and then hiding from a citizen who has just had enough of his BS could be my favorite audit of all time. Called 911 30 minutes ago, 40 minutes ago. Nothing happened. Now the police are adding insult to injury, and rightfully so. So, did anything get physical between you and this other guy? He wanted to. He threatened. He threatened my life. No, I heard the video and I saw the video, and it's a good thing that you took that. Um, but no one ever got touched. He was uh, he, he was uh, being disorderly. He disturbed the peace. The auditor's honest answer should have been: Actually, there would have been a lot of touching had I not been a coward. By the way, this is Anchorage, Alaska. A place where they don't suffer fools lately. But no one ever got touched. He was uh, he, he was uh, being disorderly. After running for his very life, uh, the best that this auditor could come up with is he was being disorderly. I mean, what, what are the lessons learned today? Auditors that who are auditing post offices should avoid reading the part in Poster 7 where it prohibits filming in post offices. I mean, come on. Number two, auditors need a better uh, early warning system to avoid private citizens that aren't fearful of their cameras and who will kick their butts despite being threatened by this coward. The John Legato Show is being broadcast from outside the gates of Marine Corps Base Camp Lejeune in beautiful North Carolina. Please subscribe and like Semper Fidelis.